Good evening. My name is Chris Wilson. I represent Labor's Local 785. My name is Chris Wilson. I represent Labor's Local 785 here in Binghamton. Our members work and live in Shenango and surrounding counties. They travel throughout these counties for work opportunities. We currently have many members traveling to Pennsylvania, um, currently working in the natural gas industry. Natural gas development across the state is estimated to bring in a billion dollars in new revenues to local and state governments, spurring the creation of new jobs for local labor. This ban is denying Shenango this opportunity. Labors are already, are, are already losing out, sometimes joining their neighbors in Pennsylvania and realizing new job opportunities. Premature local action in our municipality will negatively impact the competitive environment of all New York State for natural gas development and jeopardize the potential $11.4 billion in statewide economic impact. Recent studies suggest that development will increase some 15 18, excuse me, 15 to 18,000 jobs in the southern tier and western New York regions, which lost a combined 48,000 payroll jobs between 2000 and 2010. Already in the region, in Shimon County, there's already been new buildings, hotels, airport work, office, office expansion, and the natural gas impact in Pennsylvania. State officials are developing standards to ensure the safe development of our natural gas resource based on the expertise of DEC employees and such advisors. Development of our natural gas resource is currently prohibited pending, pending the DEC plan and final approval by, by the New York State Governor. Future local action in our municipality could negatively impact competitive environment of all of New York State for natural gas development and jeopardize the potential $11.4 billion in statewide economic impact development. Preserving competitive environment for development in New York State <clears throat> compared to the neighboring states will be critical to the economic future of our region. We, the membership of Labor's Local 785, live here, work here, and pay taxes here, I urge you to wait for the release of the state's final SEP. 